So what I'm gonna try to do today is fix this audio jack. I um, accidentally messed it up. I walked through the cable and it yanked it off. So most likely what's wrong with it now is the soldering in it has come loose. So I need to pop the front panel off. I've already popped some of these clips off. And the way I usually do it is using a socket like this, which closes the clips together. It's usually pretty easy to push it out. I did have to remove this um, drive bay so I could access these last two clips. Damn, this is dirty. This is where the headphones plug into. And I don't clearly see where the soldering has come loose. I'm going to go give this a quick blast with the air compressor. Get it cleaned up. Got it cleaned up. Just realized it's screwed in, so I'm going to unscrew it to work with it like that. I don't see anything wrong with it other than it's a little dirty. You can see that metal where it makes contact. I'm thinking maybe it was pushed in a little too far, so I took a tweezer and try to push it back out a little bit coming in from behind yeah i shoved the tweezer in there i'm gonna test it out right now it's not really working any better it's pretty sporadic if i move it slightly yeah you see it goes away i really don't want to desolder this it's, there's only three contact points it seems it did seem to recognize the headphones right away once I pushed that metal part on the left to the inside. But after disconnecting it and reconnecting it, it started being uh, iffy again. So I'm thinking knocking the headphone plug out, it uh, pushed that clip to the left and it lost its tension. I'm going to try to push it inwards as far as I can, hopefully regain some of that tension. Worst case, I break it off because, yeah, it bent back this way, so bending it back inwards is just going to cause it to be weaker wherever the the crease is at it's not working great i'm thinking maybe i could shove like a little piece of paper in there just so that it doesn't come back this way working better now but by better i mean at least it's detecting it more but uh the sound's still not coming through from the left channels all the time unless i adjust it a bit yeah it's only coming out from the left it's only coming out from the left if it comes out at all it'll say that uh the headphones detected but then there will be no sound so I'm just going to desolder it completely. Seems like more time than it's worth. You can just buy like a front panel audio thing. But that's wasteful as well. Looks like I broke it. This right foot right here. Yeah, it broke off. Because I was trying to do this with no assistance. Just my hands. There's the other piece. And it's actually two different metal pieces. This goes inside of here. Took the headphone jack and moved it over to the, I mean, I moved, took the uh, mic jack and moved it over to the headphone jack. Don't know what happened to my solder, so I had to make do. It's pretty crappy, but whatever. If it works, it works. Or it could be that the prongs on this aren't long enough. I did notice some of them weren't as long as the uh, headphone jack. Finally got the solder in. I think I might have burned the traces. Held the soldering iron too close to the board. See, there's a couple spots right there. Oops. Uh, hopefully it's not that and it's just that this mic jack isn't compatible with the speaker jack. It is an input, not an output. I'm not sure it makes a difference though. I'm gonna take this off, take the mic jack off, put it back where it goes and try to put the headphone jack back on. I think I might have actually fixed the physical problem that was wrong with it. I took the back clip off and bend a couple things just so that it makes better contact with the plug. But yeah, time to swap them out. Hey, I didn't fuck it up completely. It's working. Not 100%, but as you can see, it's still a little loose, but it's not as bad as it was before. It started working the first time I plugged it in. And I do think it's because uh, that rear it's not making contact back there in the back but yeah it's good enough it doesn't look like even when it does come loose you have to spend that much time adjusting it to get it right you can see it's kind of popping out on the right side i guess you can't